Hi everyone, hope you're doing absolutely awesome. This is going to be a quick overview of the Cold Steel Lynn Thompson Coboon. Sorry, uh, I don't really know how to pronounce that. Hopefully I didn't massacre the pronunciation. I think it means ancient text in Japanese. If you look on the rear of the box, we actually have Lynn Thompson's actual signature written in a black Sharpie pen. So looking at the knife, we have a blade length of just about exactly 5.5 inches and we have a handle length not including the guard of four and a quarter inches we have a blade thickness of 120 thousandths so less than an eighth of an inch thick um, you can see the handle is quite narrow um, the, the width at the center of the swell is uh, 58, 0.58 inches and the thickness at the thinner portions of the handle are about 0 0.40 inches. Unfortunately, on this particular copy of the knife, the secondary bevel on the left and right sides are ground at different angles. So if you look at the secondary bevel on this side, it's quite a bit wider than on the other side. Maybe that's hard to see. I think the difference in angles is about five degrees, so it is significant. So that's a little bit disappointing, although the rest of the grind is okay. The sheath is constructed of glass reinforced nylon, which cold steel refers to as Securex. And on one side of the sheath, is a metal clip which is removable but is not reversible because the clip is asymmetric. Retention of the knife in the sheath is excellent and there's essentially no rattle at all so that's very good. Unfortunately this clip does not retain the sheath in your belt or inside your waistband at all. You can see there's no hook on the end of the clip. I think you could probably heat the clip up and bend it in a vise and form a hook on the end so it would retain the clip in your your waistband or on your belt. But this is a bit disappointing that Cold Steel did that. You can also buy the plastic Cold Steel um, belt clips and affix it to the holes in the sheath. So I think that's what I'm going to do. This has been a quick overview of the Cold Steel Lynn Thompson Coboon. I'd like to thank you for watching and have a great day. Bye now.